uh, Marilyn Monroe like? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey Kern County, Megan Pearson, your director of Countywide Communications back this week and today we're out at Cal State to celebrate some of our amazing athletes. First of all, we want to wish good luck to a few of our CSUB wrestlers. Sean, Russell, and Dominic will be competing this weekend at the NCAA Wrestling Championships. So good luck to you guys. We also want to give a quick shout out to Curtis on the Cal State track and field team. He is in the number one spot for the third week in a row for his 800 meters. So he's running fast and there's no way I could catch him. but. Congrats. We also want to give a shout out to the Centennial High Mock Trial team who will compete this weekend in Sacramento for the championships in Mock Trial. So good luck guys. For our last shout out, we want to give our friend Jovi Mongold a quick good luck. She's competing this weekend for the Miss Team California on Sunday. So Jovi, best of luck to you and we'll keep our fingers crossed. Now let's talk about what's going on around the county. Uh, right now, the Bakersfield Condors are hosting a blood drive from now until March 27th. So if you get on down to Houch and Blood Bank, um, you can get a two-for-one ticket for their first responders night, which is March 27th. So get out and support your community and visit Houch and Blood Bank. This weekend, Ridgecrest is having their home and leisure show. It's out at the Desert Empire Fairgrounds on Saturday and Sunday, the 23rd and 24th, it's free admission, and on Saturday they're having a farmer's market. This Sunday, McFarland is hosting a celebration for the McFarland High girls basketball team and their Valley Championship win. It's gonna be Sunday at 9 a.m. at the Cross Point Baptist Church, so get out to McFarland on Sunday and support our local girls. We also wanna wish you a very happy first day of spring. A lot of people are getting out and enjoying the flowers. If you do get out there, if you go out to say Tahone or the Antelope Valley Poppy Reserve or anywhere else in the county, we ask that you respect the trails and the flowers themselves. So please don't pull them out of the ground. Please stay on the marked trails, don't trample them and make sure that they're here for everyone to enjoy. Yesterday at the Board of Supervisors meeting, we learned about the Hart Park Master Plan, which is a very comprehensive plan to update our 98 year old park. So if you are interested in being part of that plan moving forward, we'd love for you to come to the Parks Commission meeting. It's on March 27th at 6.30 at our 1115 Truxton building. So please come out and support. We'd love to have some young people come out and tell us how they see the parks uh, being used in the future. So come hang out with us and tell us what you wanna see. That's what's going on around the county this week. So we hope you enjoy the beautiful spring weather and the flowers and we'll see you next week.